Like today in my vlog there's gonna be two things. I'm gonna go through my favorite cosmetics but before doing that I'm gonna start with uh, charcoal mask challenge. So the rules of the game is that I'm gonna call the person, I'm gonna challenge the person to make also on her or his face this charcoal mask because in my opinion this is the most harmful mask ever. You will see later why I'm saying it's not uh, nice. So I start with putting the mask on my face. In the meanwhile, while I'm putting the mask, I'm gonna talk later about this cosmetics that I brought and I have here. I can play my hint that this is the mask that I'm using now. Charcoal mineral from Dead Sea, lifting mask, skin refining, tightening and firming. Paraben free, hormone free, sulfate free, dye free, so basically almost miracle. I applied my mask, we have now 15-20 minutes. Let me um, yeah, clean, clean my hands because you can see I look a little bit muddy. So, one second. I'm gonna go through my favorite cosmetics, the shampoo that I use right now. It's Rain Pure Advanced Argan Oil, zero sulfate, zero parabens, no so basically it's super natural. The main ingredients, this is like coconut oil, argan oil, some red seaweed, it smells pretty good. It has milky white texture and it's good for foaming and this is again my favorite conditioner also zero sulfate zero parabens no it says that they add a tea tree oil and lemon sage uh i like it i'm almost finished this bottle i bought it both the shampoo and conditioner here in new york like maybe a month ago so it stays for a pretty long time you can see for like over four weeks these two bottles are still on my shelf in bathroom and this is the toothpaste I used recently this one it's Tom's of Main Botanically Bright Whitening Toothpaste which I bought it in Whole Foods it's not expensive, maybe $3 I think yeah, about $3 they say it's no artificial colors, no flavors, no fragrance, no preservatives it's with B propolis and xylitol and it's and it's with peppermint, so it's very fresh, gentle. So I have here one, two, three, five products, and it's three in one. So this is mask, peeling, and moisturizer and cleanser in one. Grapefruit extract, peppermint extract, jojoba. I think I paid for this like five euro in Paris. The cream I use right now, this is one of the cheapest cream, but to be honest guys, I don't care. There are so many great products that are completely natural and they are cheap, but this one is really inexpensive and it's very good. And this is the brand that I discovered myself here in US. This is Petal Fresh Botanicals. Uh, it has lots of natural ingredients inside, like raspberry, avocado oil, aloe vera. And it costs three dollars, guys. Three dollars. So it's very, very cool thing. Also from this brand, I have this clay mask. It's very easy to apply. It's based on avocado and green tea. Uh, so this is my one of the favorites, if not. The most favorite clay mask it's so easy because well I like clay but it's sometimes difficult to, uh, well it's not difficult but you need to have a powder or some little container mixed with uh, uh, warm water and then apply and then it's a little bit muddy and messy but this one is very cool it's very easy to to use I'm not gonna show you now because I have this mask on but highly recommend, it's very cool, it costs only $3 and it lasts, I think I have it for 
whew, three months no I think more like four months and I use it like twice per week so it's very efficient and uh, so that was the super organic natural part of my cosmetics and I have two more products uh, more fancy let's say um, so this is the Shiseido cream highly hydrating very good cream uh, I like it easy to apply easy to moisture in your face uh, so it's a very cool product it's not cheap though it's not cheap well, I don't use my much makeup but just before putting foundation it's it was a very good base and the last one I loved but I think yesterday I just used my last drop you can see like how like how much I like it this is the product from Skin Iceland and this is Camelina oil this is Arctic face oil and this guys it's amazing so that was the review of my cosmetics now it's time to take it finally because this is crazy so let's start to do it oh my god you can hear it this is this mask is crazy like seriously i don't know who made idea about this but as they say you need to sacrifice to be pretty or whatever <laughs> okay almost there I look like panda now or cow, I don't know. <laughs> Ouch! Jesus Christ! Ow! Ow, this hurt. Ow. I feel like my baby hair are, are, are going with this. I don't want to lose my eyebrows. The skin for now feels good, but I'm gonna, of course, wash, wash it and clean it in a second and rinse with water. Uh, but before I do it, I want to challenge... And I want to challenge my friend Zosha, yes, who was also the first guest of my Rantok series. You can see it here, the link. So my lovely Zosha, my dearest friend, I really love you and I want to challenge you and do this charcoal mask challenge because it's fun, it's really fun and I know you can do it and after that you're gonna challenge another person. So be careful guys because you never know you may have a challenge uh, waiting for you with this charcoal mask. I think I'm losing my face, I think I'm losing my hair, it's like a wax. Jesus. Feels so smooth. Anyway, that was my charcoal mask challenge. You saw the review of my favorite cosmetics. So happy Sunday! In case of any more questions, follow my blog, follow me on Instagram, biaola.blog. Uh, link is here. My YouTube channel, more stuff are coming. And yeah, I wish you a very happy Sunday. Ciao!